YouTube, what's up again? I'm back with another video as always. Man, I done fell off, y'all. Don't be too mad at me. I'm supposed to drop a video every two days. It's like a third day, day going without dropping a video. I've been super busy with back to school haircuts. I'm talking about I'm gaining more clientele. I'm learning more, so y'all gotta bear with me. But I'm still gonna try to drop every two days. I'm I I'm gonna hold that. I hold that against me. I'm dropping one every two days. But yeah, this video, some smooth, something we did before. Actually, it's a low fade a transformation video. But I'm about to use my own product, my twins moisturizing cream in this video. I'm about to show y'all how to apply it, how how to use it, what it's good for, and everything. But let's hop in this video first. So as we know, this is a low fade. I had my while seniors on there, I was going all around the whole head. Now I got my, my liners. Just the ball at the very bottom, you know. Keep Take notes of these videos because it's like the same style that I use on all my haircuts. Really, I, I use the same styles, the same methods. So if any of y'all see these methods and want to use them, y'all can try it out for yourself just to see how it is, just to work it out. This is the methods that I use. Like I said, everybody... Preference is different. You can move how you want to move, do what you want to do. But this is just how I work my magic with my clippers. Now I'm going around his whole head like that. This is a, a transformation haircut too. Because he came in looking crazy. But the end result is going to be flawless. I'm going around his whole head. Just with my wall, seniors, wall designers, designers, I'm flicking out, going around. You know, make my little guideline, which is easy to flick out after a while. But yeah, man, I'm, I should get some more products too coming in. I got some, tw I did the Twins Beard Oil. We got the Twins Moisturizing Cream. If y'all got any ideas or anything next y'all want to see us do, let me know too. I can come up with another product too. I got some tricks up my sleeve, but I'm just holding out on those for right now. I got some other stuff going on, but I'm, I'm just, this whole thing, this hustling thing is, I love it. Like, if you're a barber and you, you want to get your own product, go online, look at some stuff, see what you can do, because you can come up with your own product, man. Your clients will love it. I have all natural products that I sell. I don't sell nothing harmful to you. Everything I'm selling is all natural. Cause I'm using, I'm giving y'all what I use on my head. If I don't, if I wouldn't use it on my head, I wouldn't sell it to y'all. That's just, that's not me. I'm giving y'all everything that I use. Man, I'm just super busy. But we just fast forward it. I'm just knocking it down with my one and a half. That's the length that he wanted. And I'm starting with my liner in the front. It's always, I start in the middle and then go to the right. Making it clean and crispy. Line it up, you know. The same as always, the same method, the same steps. With the TL liners. Getting them crispy. Not pushing it back, just touching it basically. And that's my fading process. I got my guard on my designers, and I'm just flicking out, and I'm combing it to make sure I'm laying the hair down and see where the hair is going. I always cut his hair. He's a, a regular, so I know it's where his hair is going, so it's, it's, I don't have to be cautious or nothing like that with his hair, because I know how his head is. And I'm going to flick all around the whole head, make it smooth and easy, Get, getting this fade all the way together. This fade, fade came out. Good as I should say, it came out flawless. Like when you see the end, it's it's well blended. Like I said, I'm doing this is my method of going. I move fast when I work because I've been doing this for a while. Take your time, man. If you doing a haircut, take your time. Go at your pace. You ain't got to go at my pace. I mean, once you get skilled, you can go to whatever pace you want to do. You can go slow. You can go fast, but. Over time, you'll start to you'll start to go faster. 
and you will start to see your time increasing too. Like when I first started cutting hair, I, it would take me about 45 minutes to do a haircut. Then it went down to 30 minutes to do a haircut. And over time, it went down to 20 minutes to do a haircut. And now I finally, right now, this present day, it takes me about 15 minutes to do a haircut. And which that makes we get more money too because when I, how I do my appointments is I do my appointments every 15 minutes. No, I do my appointments every 30 minutes, but I can cut ahead in 15 minutes. So I strongly suggest my clients to come exactly on time. If they come exactly on time, I can that gives me enough time to squeeze somebody else in. If I have somebody at 3 o'clock and he come right on time at 3 o'clock, he getting in my chair at 3 o'clock. And I walk in, come in, and say, "Hey, can you can you can you can squeeze me in?" I look at my watch and say, "Oh yeah, it's three o'clock. I'll be done with him in fifteen minutes. By three fifteen, I should be wrapping him up. And nine times out of ten, three fifteen, I I do be wrapping him up. But like three fourteen, I'd be almost done. Or sometimes maybe like three sixteen, three seventeen, be a little late. But I know I still got time. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm done with him. Come on, you can come in. Let me knock you out. It's fifteen minutes. Knock you out right quick. But you gotta know what like type of haircuts." to do like if it's an afro he want it shaped up with a taper it's like uh, i can't i can't squeeze him in man. but if it's like a regular haircut like a, um low fade a taper ball fade that's it's kind of fast and easy you can go ahead and knock him out in the breeze so i'm just putting this liner on the side too with my ti liners and his ti liners one of the goats again Getting them crispy together, getting them all the way in there. About to make them look like a whole different person. Keeping it nice and neat. Flick out, flick, flick. Just ball it just a little bit. Just staying low with the baldness, you know, not going up too high. I'm going to go ahead and flick out, flick out, flick out, flick out. Same thing to the back of the beard. Uh, getting them all the way in there. Getting them all the way in there. Yeah, came out crispy. Yeah, I use enhancers on this video. I wasn't even paying attention when I was um doing my voiceover as I'm doing this voiceover. But yeah, I did use enhancers. If it showed, yeah, I was using enhancers. I used my barber magic pencil. I was so busy talking about something else. And I'm doing the same thing to the other side around here. Look how that one side is blended so well. It's like, it's crazy. Like, y'all don't know how amazed I'd be at my own haircut sometimes. I'd be like, dang, especially when they leave out the shop. And you see the haircut in the sun. It's like, dang, it's like, I didn't know. It looked like that. Like, the sun tells you everything. It gives away all the flaws, and it tells you, it shows you all the detail in the cut. And like I said, whatever you do on one side, you got to do on the other side. So, I'm doing the same thing to this side. Flicking it up. Line it up, get them crispy. Then I'm going to flick out the little line on the side. Getting that fade even. Getting them crispy, crispy. You know how that be. Flick them around. But yeah, I've got to tell you, I'm getting a, I ordered me a GoPro. So I'm about to see how that is. So my next videos, well not next videos, I got probably got like two, three more videos with my camera. And after that, I'm going to use my Go, my 4K GoPro. I'm about to see how that's like. So all my videos should look way different. My quality should look better. Everything should look cool. Like, I'm improving. It's like this the thing about this whole YouTube career, this whole YouTube process. It's like, I want to see myself grow. And I know I'm going to see myself grow. Like, I'm learning new things with this YouTube stuff. Sooner, I'm going to have music in my background in a minute. And I'm all off topic with this video because, like I said, this is a low fade. I'm not really doing a little tutorial on this video. I'm just showing y'all my product at the end that I'm apply to his hair and how to use it and everything. But I'm just talking about the YouTube process right now. So this you can look at the haircut and just see how it's going. But I'm gonna be talking. I'm talking all, 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 all everywhere in this video, all out of portion. But yeah, I'm just, I'm, like I said before, this YouTube stuff kind of cool because I'm learning with this. And I'm about to knock everything out. 
all my vid you, if y'all with me right now watching these videos y'all gonna see how 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 they change how they evolve over time like how my videos gonna go from this to that I'm gonna go viral but I'm gonna still stay humble I'm gonna always stay humble y'all know that but yeah we just figuring it out I, I don't even have a guard on it I don't think no I don't no, I don't. I was flicking out. My, I didn't have a guard on there. I was just not getting that, flicking it out, getting that out. Now we're doing the other side of this beard. Getting them crispy, crispy. Making that beard gang look good. But my, my next video I got for y'all going to be a treat. It's, some, it's hair that I never did before. So it's going to be a full tutorial on my other video. But like I said, we got some good stuff coming for y'all. Keep watching this video. At the end, I got some good stuff coming. Good information for y'all. Yeah, I use my enhancers on this. I did use my enhancers on this beard. Beard and mustache. Everything. Look at that fade. Like this, it came out clean. Look, look, how, look how crispy his beard is. Crispy, crispy, sharp. You want to make all your clients sharp, man. Make them crispy, crispy. Mm. Crispy, 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 crispy. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that. Mm -hmm. It's like a lot of people been asking for these hiccups too lately. These fades, like low fades, ball fades, drop fades. These like the new businessmen haircuts now, cause they popular. They getting more popular every day. I'm getting more and more of these. Learn the process of it. Yeah, getting the lip, getting everything crispy. All right, now I'm about to hop in a Twins Moisturizing Cream. All right, now Twins Moisturizing Cream is a cream me and my twin brother made. It contains all natural products, shea butter, coconut oil, aloe vera gel, and essential oils. Now, this is good for your skin, scalp, nails, everything. You can put this on your head, then turn around and rub it on your face. <laughs> That's how good it is. All natural products, like I said, it keeps your scalp moist. Keeps you if you want waves, it keeps your waves smooth, healthy, keep all your hair looking flawless, good, all natural, no chemicals. So it's all it's doing nothing but good to your hair. I put this in my hair like twice a day, once in the morning, once at night. I use it for a good wave cream as I, I use it for. You know, I put it in my hair, then I brush it and have my wave have my waves looking good. At that time I do rag on. It has a good smell to it. And I have some at the shop that you all can purchase. It's seven dollars. That's it. Seven dollars. It'll last you for a while too. You know, like I said before, all natural. You want to use natural. That's the way to go. Yo, like, subscribe, share, and I appreciate y'all. Peace out.